We're good at today. I'm going to see if how I can put two images side by side. So a split screen of two on Premiere Pro. So we're going to do between the Holy Stone and the DGI. So I want to get the videos from there. So we can just drag them straight into the timeline. So we want to put do the editing first and then we're going to crop it. So first want to edit the holy stone. Let's do that first. I might speed it up on sections so I'm not until we get to the crop. I'm just going to do some colouring, increase the colour changes. So I think I'll we'll put it at so 125 at 25. I'm going to basic auto. It's better. Still uh, got a little bit tinted. Uh, as I said just before I forget, got to put some colour to the pro our images here because uh, this is D so it's light grey. So actually, you don't necessarily have to have it like that in uh, Premiere Pro. You can get it automatic, so it puts automatically puts colour, but it just means that you can work the colour more in uh, Premiere Pro. Auto. Auto. So it does take a few seconds for all the images to render. Get a bit more colour. Go to creative. 125. 125. 25. I think the tint is okay. Uh, 
Doesn't seem to have as much colour depth as. I need a bit more colour just to bring out the saturation to uh, 150. Let's see if that helps. got the colour but the tints really kind of seems to shade a lot from when you go up and down. It's a bit over overdone I think. Overdone in some spots for where you look down, it's makes it a little bit difficult to edit the colors. Let's try, uh, so uh, basically, so let's get 50%, scale 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, right so now both should be at 50 percent each right through so now we got to undo that one So going to move to a position. Uh, also, if you go to here, you can set the controls. So we've got the ruler that's locked, and uh, snap is on. So now, can move on there and move that there. So we just uh, move each one to the, as we go through it. So that one, so that's there. So I want this one here. Make sure I cr uh, Don't have to worry about the repositioning this one because it's only for that side because I got a bit longer with the holy stone and I'll also talk a bit longer I think about 
fifty hosts and since I've had it longer. So resize that to one hundred percent. Let's move it out here position. Okay. I have to do that for all of these. So basically how you do the the effects with the two put two side by side. Now we just have to save it, export it. Okay, export. So eight minutes to do that. So that'll take a couple of minutes to do that. So do, that's how to do split screens in Premiere Pro.